Hello and welcome to my channel Green Line Goddess Tarot. Uh, this is your daily reading for September, September the 9th, 2021. A little bit later today, uh, but better late than never, <laughs> we say. So let's see what energy is coming in for the day for September the 9th. Hope you're all doing well. So let's see. Six of Swords. Nice. Things are moving in a nicer, more peaceful direction. Five of Swords, maybe away from this guy, which is some kind of conflict. And uh, it's kind of interesting. I felt compelled to wake up this morning and, and see where Chiron was because I'm like, oh, Chiron's doing something weird, the planet Chiron associated with the wound. And, of course, Chiron is actually in an exact opposition to Mercury. So I'm like... Ah, that explains why people have been ignoring me and not answering me and it's been kind of triggering a wound inside of me. So it could have been some kind of, I mean, some kind of communication with someone uh, that has, uh, that is passing. It felt like it just, it passed and the Six of Swords were moving on, moving beyond that because at the centre we have the Nine of Cups coming back to a more centered place where really feeling a lot happier and fulfilled the knight of cups taking some very fast and quick positive action oh two knights the knight of wands so action stations towards fulfillment sorting out this conflict of the five of swords and at the base we have the nine of pentacles so yep conflict resolution i think that whatever whatever was kind of a little thorn in your side perhaps like a conversation or a lack of response from somebody uh, or even ignoring a silence uh, any even an argument of some sort or even just a little bit of like irritability irritability uh, anyway uh, that kind of it just feels like there was a bit of tetchiness in the air uh, perhaps between just and it felt kind of surface you know you could be this could be something that was happening with people you are closest with because sometimes you know that's what when you are in a grumpy mood sometimes you do take it out on them more than other people so it does feel like it's a, a sense of things kind of if there was a little bit of a conflict that things go back to feeling a lot better again and there, it could happen quite quickly. So that's why I feel like something blows, an energy that uh, could be causing you a little bit of grief just blows over quite quickly and things start to flow again. But it is a sense of uh, I do feel like a lot of desire for resolution from not even only you but perhaps from the other party as well. So I do feel like there's some kind of relationship conflict that is has come up or a wound of some sort and so we have the two nines that are kind of the happy places the nine of pentacle and the nine of cups and both of them are you know very independent energies of abundance gratitude and fulfillment so seeing that in your life choosing to be in that energy not the energy of conflict and so that's where we're seeing the six of swords uh the five of swords moving into a place of greater peace, moving beyond that. So things start to become a little bit more socially lubricant. Things start to move again. Perhaps you can kind of forgive and move on from something. So, you know, things are, there are some good things around in this reading and really the nights are uh, making a change, just a shift and a change. Perhaps usually, you know, we've got three swords here, three cards of swords, a six, a five and the knight. And that can be just making both the knight and the five can be making just a few shifts in your mental approach or your mental understanding. You know, you can have that those days where you're just really annoyed at somebody and then the next day it goes. And it's kind of like, you know, that energy that was really irritating me is gone. And uh, it's kind of got that energy that something has blown over, which is good. So it allows you to move forward positively. And the Six of Swords can also be around the fact that uh, you could be thinking about moving or relocating or traveling in some sense. So that also is a nice energy. But in general, it is very much like a mutable energy of a Gemini energy. In fact, we have two Gemini energies of the Knight of Swords and the Six of Swords uh, of things being able to uh, limber up, limber up your mental faculties. <laughs> so 
that's the energy of the day and the nine of pentacles brings a lovely independence independent spirit feeling pretty happy within yourself and feeling pretty abundant so yeah i mean all in all a few minor adjustments and i think you should be feeling pretty good today so thanks so much for joining me and i look forward to seeing you tomorrow